Hi, it's Casey D, and you're watching Why Tell Me Why. This week we're answering your questions. We want to find out why certain foods are just toxic to dogs. So I'm going to take you to my kitchen, we're here now, and we're going to look through my kitchen cabinet to see what I have, which your dog, my dog, no dogs, should eat. So let's take a peek. Well, everyone knows chocolate, and of course I have chocolate, but my dog can't have chocolate. Also, raisins and grapes are not good for dogs. And a new one, it's called xylitol, it's a sweetener. It's found in gum and sugar-free cookies and things like that. Extremely poisonous to dogs, cannot eat it. I spoke with a veterinarian who explains why this happens. The dogs have very similar tastes to what we have, and they like the taste of chocolate. And they don't discriminate between eating a Hershey's Kiss and eating a huge box of baking chocolate you've gotten for the holidays. And chocolate contains an active ingredient called theobromine, and that can cause severe respiratory distress and some other things in dogs. So as a general rule of thumb, it's best to just keep your dog away from all chocolate products. It could kill them. They could go into cardiac arrest, into heart arrest. There is a sweetener. There's a lot of artificial sweeteners on the market now, and many of those are safe for human and dog consumption. However, one named xylitol, Z-Y-L-I-T-O-L, has found to be severely, severely dangerous to dogs, even in very small amounts. It's a wood-based artificial sweetener commonly found in sugarless gums, in toothpaste, and also in a lot of sugar-free cookies. Well, we know dogs. Dogs like cookies. It doesn't take very much to make a dog really, really sick. What happens to them? Number one, it causes severe hypoglycemia. That's a very, very low blood sugar. And that's occurred in dogs, even with a big dog, eating as much as just two or three cookies. Really surprising. At higher levels, say the dog that ate the entire package of cookies or chewed up the big box of gum you got at a price club type situation, uh, has actually caused severe hepatic, which is liver failure, and death. So if you have any products containing xylitol, you want to make sure you keep them away from your dog. In general, dogs can kind of pretty much eat what we do, but no chocolate, no raisins or grapes, no onions, no xylitol, artificial sweetener. Thanks for watching Why Tell Me Why. Any questions you have, you can email me at whytellmewhy at discovery.com, and I will try my best to answer those questions for you on air. Hi, we're the Discovery News video team, and we want your videos. Your science videos, to be exact. So if you're a student doing experiments at home, or a researcher in the field, and if you have a camera, then capture those experiments and upload them to our website. It's pretty easy. Here's how you do it. Just go to this website below, dfc.discovery.com slash news slash sidewalk science. And if they get our Bunsen's burning, we will put them online and you will be recognized for the mad genius you really are. That's all I have to say.